Let's elaborate on guided buying. I have seen in the internet someone was writing, guided buying is create a purchase requisition in your ERP, convert this into a purchase order, receive your goods, post a goods receipt in your ERP, and finally wait for the invoice and post this also in your ERP system. Is this guided buying? No, never, not in my point of view. Guided buying means you want to guide the user in this shopping procedure. What do you need? Two key elements. The first one is you need a very strong AI-driven search engine. Compare Google, compare Amazon. They can guide you to find the correct product, number one. Number two is if you don't find your product, you need some AI-driven web forms which are guiding you through this service item or some specification that you have to insert into that form. So these two elements, they are forming guided buying. And finally, once you have collected all of this, you put your items into the shopping basket, which forms the purchase requisition. And from here, the P2P process is starting in your ERP system. It means procure to pay. Let's have a short look how this looks in a system. This here is a modern procurement system with guided buying. Let's search now for a scanner and fax machine and you are presented a search result list immediately. On the left side, you can also see marketplace items which are pre presented to you like Amazon Business and others. Now let's go into the product details where you can still double check the information. Left side, you can still navigate through other search items and now adding this item to the basket is confirming this to the shopping basket. As a next step, I would also like to order installation services, which doesn't exist as a product. So I have to be guided through a web form. I have to answer several questions like, what's your product category? What's your budget? So I'm answering all of this. And finally, the system is also asking me if I have an offer. In other case, I would have to create a request, a price request to the supplier, but I'm saying, no, I have, I have it. So now I continue with further specification entering product description for that installation service, uh, my price estimation, etc. And finally, I can add this item, which is this installation service, also into my basket. Now, having both items in my basket, I will now, as a next step, just say, okay, I'm ordering this. And by ordering, I'm creating an SAP, my purchase requisition, and I'm creating it in real time. So this purchase requisition is now in sub. When you click now on my cards, you can see this purchase requisition on the top of the list. This is that what I have created just right now in real time. And from here on, this P2P process can continue. So it means purchase order, goods received, invoice, etc. This P2P process will continue, of course, in SAP. And we can also support this with additional cloud features. But this is a story for the next time. Thank you for watching.